Hi guys, Bulldog Tech here with another technical video. Um, in this video, we'll show you how to fix your Windows 10 update issues for KB4530715. And the error code most people are getting is the 0x800 F0982. Okay, let's get cracking. Um, so, first thing I would always check for is my storage space. So to check your storage space if you click file explorer this pc it'll bring up a list of disks for me i have plenty of space for an update but make sure yours isn't red if it's red please free up some space then re-download the update and apply it and i'm sure it should work if your space is okay move on to the next step Good thing I always try is the Windows Update Error Fix, which is a software from Microsoft. I'll leave a link in the description. Yeah, it's fixed Windows Update Errors. If you scroll down, it'll ask you a question of what operating system are you getting the error on, which is obviously Windows 10. But for you do the same for Windows 8.1 and 7. So we select Windows 10. And the next step is to download the Windows Update Troubleshooter. It's going to take seconds. So there it is there, WU10 DIAG CAB. So you click that. That asks us to select what the problem actually is. So ours is Windows Updates. Then click Next. Detecting problems. It just might be found. Troubleshoot with administrative permissions. So if we click try troubleshooting as an administrator, that will rerun the software as an administrator. So we will then select Windows Update again, select Next, detecting problems, check the pending restart. It should only take a couple of seconds and hopefully it will fix the issue for you. But for me, it couldn't identify the problem. So I will then close the screen down and move on to the next step. So the next link is the Windows Update Catalog. So this is a massive catalog of updates produced by Microsoft. Every update they release should be in this catalog. So the update is this here. So any other oh, any sorry any other data area you have, you would then copy that. And type the update in here. Click paste. Click search. So you can see there's four updates. So what we're looking for is depending on the architecture of your PC, if it's 64-bit or if it's 32-bit. To find this out, if you don't know it already, you can right-click your start button select system scroll it down and there it is there system type 64 bit x64 base processor so I will then download this one here which is 300 megabytes once I've downloaded it will then try to install the update hopefully that works for you if it doesn't move on to the next step which is to reset the Windows service update service. So for this we need to click start, type CMD, right click your mouse, run as administrator, we then select yes. So what we need to do now is copy and paste each command and paste it in stop yep 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 yes so down the steps we're basically turning off some services we're then renaming this file here which is the main store for your updates then we're renaming this file then what we're doing is restarting all the services basically reinstalling the, the update service 
So you can see there, successful, successful, successful. So from that, you would then go to your Windows updates again and try and reinstall the update. And hopefully all these steps is basically fixes your issue. Please post in the comment section and let us know if it's worked for you. I'd like to thank you, take your time for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.